All right, guys. We are going to do a little night fishing night out on the surf. I've got some. I don't have big shark tackle, you know. I've got some of my catfish gear. I want to throw out the shark. But now my buddy Jericho here, he's got the setup. He's got some high dollar setups right here, all lined up right here. So got them all lined up. We got some big, huge baits on them. So we're gonna set up. And I've actually got a couple rods out now trying to get some smaller baits to where maybe I can get in, I can get into smaller sharks, whatnot. So hang with us tonight and we'll see what happens, guys. All right, guys. Got it. Finally got some bait here. Well, that's a nice whiting. All right, guys. I'm going to cut this guy off and use this guy for bait. All right, we got a takedown on one of the shark rods. Got him. short run then a better run then he stopped so we're just kind of waiting to see if he's going to take off this run here Still take a line? Nope. I am deaf. But I was all the way down there, I hear Alright. Little sharks, little sharks. I just tied up one for you. Alright guys, we got a shark on. I'm gonna run down here and get my light. Alright right, guys, a little update. We just sat through an absolutely torrential monsoon. We got us a little pooch set up over there that light. We got the main shark rods over there. You can probably see the glowing lights. And I've got a shark rod with smaller stuff here and here. Then I got two rods baited up with like some squid. Just to keep things interesting, but hopefully uh, the rain will hold off. Tide's coming back in now, but uh, yeah, it, things got real there for a while. So we're gonna kick back and hopefully uh, go the rest of this night without much rain. There we go. All right, guys, go a little, got a little hardhead cat here. Hey, at least you get to keep you bait. All right, guys, let's pull 
It's alright, they're a little hard head cat and Something here. I don't think it's very big, whatever it is, y'all. Yeah, it's wanting to fight now. First, it wasn't fighting way out in the surf, but now she's wanting to fight. Hey, that's me. I'm in your line here. Oh, yo, we got another hard head cat. All right, guys. Saltwater cat. Pouring down rain, had a few hits, but now we are finally hooked up and got Devin on the rod. But the problem is, it's high tide. You didn't have to see you on all this. Jericho is having to steadily pick the grass. This stuff's on the line. The entire rod's got, it's got that roller eye, and you've got to get all that grass out of there. So, I'm gonna help him out, work on it, and hopefully whatever Devin's hooked into is still there. Get down on it, buddy. You getting tired yet, Devin? <laughs> yeah, because he's running sideways now. Yeah, that's why the pull of my got all flaxy turned direction. Yeah. Fish or shark, rather, he's right here. Shark. All right, Jericho's going in after him. Huh? Ain't got a tail! 
Yeah. Tail fin bit off. All right, here we got him loose. Freaking tiger. Yeah, something, something bait this shark's tail off. It don't even have a tail. Let's get him. Yeah. Yeah, they he's been thin. Or been bit off. Might have bit off. Okay. All right. Twelve to the tail, guys. That's what we've got the measurement so far. Fifty-one inches. Tail. All right. All right, Jericho. We're gonna get this. Get this guy back. Hold that, buddy. Jericho fishing for these sharks all the time. And he absolutely loves these sharks. He'll do everything he can to make sure these sharks get back out in the surf. And get back, you know. It takes a lot of care to make sure these things are okay. And there he goes. All right, Devin, up top, baby. All right, guys, Jericho was getting that fish back, and shark skinning just like sandpaper. Look at his feet, look at that stuff that's just bleeding from. Him. Like I was just saying, guys, Jericho loves these sharks, and he takes the utmost care to make sure these things get back. Made sure the hook is out and everything, had a good release. So that fish would probably ten foot two or three. Yeah, if it would have had his tail not bit yep. off. First fish I've ever landed over ten feet on the beach. Awesome, David. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're wrapping it up from last night's shark fishing, and we're going to start a little early morning surf fishing. But I'm going to turn this into another video. Okay, that's going to be a pretty decent video with just that so but guys I appreciate you watching and uh, Devin the, the guy in the server forced you to tape off and uh, Jericho was gracious enough to those were Jericho's rods and Jericho was gracious enough to uh, allow Devin to pull that fish in so, Devin got anything to say? Uh, no but <laughs> he couldn't come up with anything witty to say but uh Jericho looked it up that shark something that happened to his tail and he looked up on a website and that shark should have been like right around 11 foot weighed around 500 something pounds by the math so pretty impressive pretty impressive so guys appreciate you watching 
We'll catch you on the next one.